What's good people, we are back for another episode of the RDC world aka the Dream Chasers career mode. If you are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and check out the playlist on the channel to get yourself up to date. This is the start of season 5, the first bit of gameplay of season 5. If you missed the last two episodes, make sure you go and check those out because there was some big things going down, especially the last one we started season 5, there was no gameplay though, but we went through a lot of how the club is going to be structured this season and what we're aiming towards. Um, so yeah, make sure you check out that last episode if you haven't already. Um, and without further ado, let's get into today's episode. We're playing Udinese in the preseason tournament. Preseason, I normally just skip over it, but with our new signing, I want to try out some new formations and see what we can cook with that. So let's jump into the game against Udinese without further ado. Look at that jumping straight into the gameplay today. Come on, I'm on smoke. So we're going to try the 4-4-2 formation first. Um, I'm expecting to just cook against these, actually, because look at the formation that they're playing. Um, I did want to actually just rotate the squad a little bit with it being pre-season. The two strikers is the main people I wanted to play, though. I'm actually going to play Billy Kearns at centre-back here. Um, and should we give Juric some game time? I'll play Tommy Bailey on the left, actually. Um, and, yeah, let's give Juric some game time over Hashimoto. But Rabajet is going to captain the squad for this game against Udinese. And let's jump into it. One man, the focus of attention. A story of youth. The manager believes in him, and we'll have all the action from his debut. I don't know why it's saying that, because it's not the first time we've played Billy Kearns, but... Oh, I forgot about our kit being yellow, bro, on the bottom. This is a stinker of a kick clash. Great interception from Juric. We've got a through ball there to Ronaldo, trying to open the scoring early. I don't know why they keep saying it's Kearns' debut, bro. He's been with us a whole season. William Rabijet, oh Rabijet, picking up where he left off from last season. He's played the ball into Lewandowski, tries to chest it down, just not cooking yet. Come on. And I keep thinking the referees on our team, bro. I keep thinking the referees on our team, bro. I've never seen the referee wear purple in the life. But of course they're wearing purple this game with our new purple kit. Oh, Juric's quality makes it. And definitely need to give him more game time this season because he is so good. Two strikers, they've hardly linked up so far this game now. Can they cook something here? Juric into Ronaldo. Nah, it just stinks. It stinks so far. Oh, Canales, that's quality. Referee, you can't do that, lad. Lewandowski was about to assist Masakiono. So far, this first half, though, boys, it's stunk. I can't lie. We have absolutely reeked in this formation. I'm missing Morgan Elliott, bro. Into the final 20 minutes. On to Barbosa. Barbosa and Lewandowski, that's the first time we've linked up for a goal. We had to force it, really, because we were going nowhere that game. Wow. But nice little one, too. That's a good pass from Barbosa and a great first-time finish from Lewandowski. What you expect from the lads. It's going to take time to get this partnership working, boys. But there we go. We're off the mark. Oh. Oh. Oh, they found the foot, and then there's two. And Villick, he's go he's going for the golden boot this season, bro. We're going to have a, a little two-way tie. Or a two-way run, whatever you want to call it, for the golden boot in the league. I can sense it. Those two are hungry, bro. Here's Lewandowski. Another nice running behind. The lad's runs have been great this game, and he wanted the hat-trick. These two are going to war, you know, because Barbosa was in the middle there looking for a pass. He's going to be fuming he didn't pass it. But can he make up for it there with the pass to Barbosa? Referee. Oi. Juric has been man of the match as well. This guy's quality, mate. Get in, boys. 2-0 win. Going to try the other formation for the next game in the, the preseason cup, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to try the other team because... I feel like in the league, if we play that formation, we will get absolutely bullied, bro. Like, I feel like there's definitely something missing there. Um, and the only reason we won is because we were simply better. What the hell is that for a picture? 
<laughs> what is that for a picture? So we had the World Cup this season in our career mode. Um, the player of the tournament has been announced as Belgium's De Ketelier, and he's gone up to an 88 overall. I remember playing Wolves that season thinking, this guy is not real. I've never heard that name in my life, but he is real, and he's 88 rated, so he's probably going to batter us this season. But Brazil won the World Cup, if you're interested in that. Um, we can see a few Brazil players in the team of the tournament there. A lot of Netherlands players, though, as well. Um, but we've got Martinelli. Uh, Bruno Gamares and Anthony. So, shout out to Brazil for winning the World Cup. We got a 10 million off F off Fulham for um, Juric, and after that performance, he's going nowhere, bro. I love this guy, quality player. Reggie Field, though, we've had a 2.65 million off F for Reggie Field, and it's one of them storylines where I don't want to say goodbye to him, but. I'm going to accept it, bro. Reggie Field, it's been an honour, mate. Yeah, you were an absolute dog forever, a club legend. But his contract's expiring at the end of this season and he won't renew it because he's handing a transfer request. So we may as well get two million for him while we can. Next game of the preseason tournament against Osasuna. We're going to use the 4-1-2-1-2 diamond formation. We're playing against a 4-4-2, which is what we've just used, of course. Um, Rebic is absolutely knackered there in that defensive mid spot. Um, we don't even have any other option. Yes, we do, actually. Billy Cairns. Utility man, Billy Cairns. I was going to loan him out this season, but after playing him then, he was actually quality. So we're going to keep him around. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to use a full strength team here, apart from obviously Rabijet in the DM, just to see how it would feel as if it was the league. Obviously, the opponent isn't as strong as we would face in a league either, but let's jump into it and see how this formation feels compared to the 4-4-2. Oh, boys. Yeah. Oh, no way. I mean, Ronaldo, bro. You've got to score that. Yeah, but we're cooking, though. Hey, this formation is feeling like it might be the one. Only sad thing about this is that Ono Masaki has no place in this squad, which is very sad. Unless we train him up as a cam and make him the Morgan Elliott replacement, maybe. Like, I don't know. But for now, Morgan Elliott is still in there cooking. Ronaldo all by himself here. Oh my god, who's that making a run? I saw Mina, couldn't find the ball, but Mina was absolutely bombing forward on the wing there. Oh my god, these two just can't pass to each other. Villick and, uh, well, I'm going to stop saying his name. Ronaldo, lad, and uh, Lewandowski, they can't pass to each other. I don't know whether it's just bad chemistry or they've got a like bit of bad blood, but they're like two magnets pointed towards each other. Here we go. Here we go, though. Oh, can we beat that defender for pace? Oh, Lewandowski, that's a great run. Oh, I thought that went in, lad. That was going to be a great goal there. But, bro, Lewandowski feels absolutely rapid on the ball. It's crazy every time I pass to him. Even though Ronaldo's got way more pace, it feels like Lewandowski is just more, like, fast. It's crazy. That's a great turn. Big block. Canales, what a tackle, mate. Elliot, think over the top. Here we go. Ronaldo, offside, no way. No way that was offside, lad. Not having that. Oh, get it out. Bloody hell, lad. I'm getting battered here, you know. We're actually getting battered. I don't know if it's the, the formation or... No, it's just me being shit. Lad, why can't me players touch the ball? What the fuck is that meaning? Every single touch about this game has been like that as well. Is it just me, boys, as well? Does this purple just not look purple in game? What the fuck are you doing, lad? Um, but yeah, lad, I feel like the, the purple doesn't even look purple. And last game, we had the referee wearing purple to match us, yeah. Now this game, the referee's wearing yellow to match us. I might just retire this home kit and never wear it. So the referees are trolling us. Here's Morgan Elliott. Oh, mate, he is that guy still. He's that guy still. We can't drop him. But then, oh, no, Masaki is that guy too. One of the strikers might have to make way, you know, boys. And we might have to just play the same formation as last year. But, like, oh, I don't know. It's a tough one. Because Morgan Elliott is, that, is him. He's him. He is Himothy. Lucas Toro. Oh, that's a great goal. How the... F I don't... No, it's not a great goal. How's that going in? The midfield has been absolutely AFK this whole, like, preseason tournament so far. That's a lie, because Joric was quality last game, but... You know what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm trying to say. Speaking of midfield, Morgan Elliott, the, the guy is ridiculous. 
The guy is absolutely insane. You see him go flying in the net then. <laughs> Yo, he is... Oh, mate, he's ridiculous, bro. Oh, that's a nice play. That is a nice play, Lewandowski. Let's go. That's a nice play, boys. Yeah, that is a nice play. Come on, Lewandowski, bro. He is going to be a problem this season. But in saying that, I'm not enjoying playing with two strikers. I can't lie. It just doesn't suit my play style. The 4-4-1-1 four, four, one, one formation that we ran all the last season, I was gelling with, bro. I knew exactly how to attack, how to defend. These two formations we've tried in pre-season here, yeah, I've not enjoyed it. I can't lie. I'm going to try the 4-4-2 four, four, again after this game but yeah this one i feel like the midfield um at least the the left center mid and right center mid i've just been absolutely afk and gotten did not get involved at all reggie field is gone boys it's a sad time but we've got 1.8 million in the bank off of that um so yeah reggie field let's see him out boys let's see him out he's a club legend i remember the first time we saw this guy with the white hair the dark goatee i thought this guy looks like a dog and he was an absolute beast for us top scorer in the english league too joint or second place in league one campaign um, for top scorer and yeah man it's a sad day to see him go but forever remembered in rdcul dream chaser history as an absolute dog and we got an a star rating for that let's go one thing i did want to do boys is promote shin maya to the um what you call it senior squad Right now, he's 17 years old, can play centre-back and right-back. He's 69 overall, 89 to 94 potential. I'm actually going to wait till the first of the month because that's when they get um, an update on those guys, which I think is actually the next day. So, yeah, let's go. <laughs> let's wait till the first of the month. There we go. Let's go back in. Shin Meyer, 93 to 94 potential. Jesus Lord. Jesus Lord, what have we found ourselves here? This is the next Van Dyke. Yeah, I'm promoting him straight away to the senior team. 94 to 93 potential. What the hell? We've got a transfer offer for Antonio Silva from Bologna. They have offered 40 million. So I'm going to delegate this again. Start the offer at, let's say, 57. And don't sell for less than 50. In fact, let's go 55 because that's cheeky otherwise. Uh, can we get 50 million for Antonio Silva? It would be absolutely huge. But yeah, man, Shin Meyer. This is the guy I want to check out. Has potential to be special. Of course he does. Development plan. I'm going to leave him as a ball playing defender. It boosts his defending stats and his weak foot, which is what we love to see. Boys, do we just bring him in? I know he's low rated. Do we bring him into the squad and just play him? Has potential to be special. Do we loan him out, bring him back in next season, but then he could lose that potential if we loan him out? That's the only thing I'm concerned about. Like, could he be the Antonio Silva replacement even though he's lower rated? Do we just give him the chance to try and shine? And he could be great. In fact, do you know what I think we do? We sell Antonio Silva. We bring in Gavardiol. We send out Maya on loan and replace Canales next season with Maya. I think that is the wise move. Even though I really do want to play him, bro. I really do want to play him. But loan list, 17 years old, bro. He's got room to grow, you know what I mean? Let's get into the final game. I think, is it final game? No, it's not final game. I don't know. We're playing Celta Vigo anyway, whatever they're called. Back to the, um, what's it called? Formation 4-4-2. I'm going to give this one another run. I'm actually going to play Shin Maia for this game. In place of Antonio Silva, the guy who he could be replacing. Antonio Silva is 89 pace, bro. That is crazy. But yeah, we're going to play Shin Maia there. Let's see how he feels in game. The rest of the team stays as it is. And let's jump into it. In fact, I'm going to use a different kit because why not? Let's switch it up instead of having the same kit for all the games. Do we go white against... Yeah, let's go white against black. I wanted to play in a blue kit, but this white kit, I want to see how it looks in game, bro, because it looks sexy on screen. So let's jump straight in. The man of the moment. Today, his big chance. The youngster named on the starting 11 for the very first He just time. looks cool as well. Don't you think? He just looks cool. He looks like a player that you could see next to Ono Masaki and Hashimoto Yuto lifting the Champions League trophy. At least that's what I see. Don't know about yous, but yeah, let's get into it. Oh yeah, this kit looks fit in game, boys, with the red. That red is shining. Yo, this kit is fire, bro. Why is it always our white kits that uh, that look amazing? Remember the white kit that we had a few seasons ago? Um, well, remember the white kits. We've had a white kit for all four, se all five seasons, but we had one a few seasons ago, and it was just gorgeous, bro. Is on Omasaki playing through Hashimoto Yuto. Can we get off to a quick start here in this game? Inside is Ronaldo. One more. Is Morgan Lee? I was thought it was going to be Lewandowski, but a quick start from the lads. Maybe the 4-4-2 is the way to go. Um, but yeah, like I say, with the 4-4-2, though, we lose Morgan Elliott, which is not great, but that was a great goal. 
Well, it is a huge occasion for the 18-year-old in the starting 11, making a senior debut today. He's been knocking on the door for a while, Stuart. Well, he certainly has. It sounds young, doesn't it? 18 years of age. But if you're going to make it, you need to... I thought Shin was 17, unless he's just had his birthday. I'll have to check. In fact, I'm checking that now. I don't know why I've paused it there. I'm going to conceive when I unpause it. He was 17 when we signed him. And yeah, he's still 17, so the commentator's chatting. He's 18. I don't know what they're talking about, mate. Unless he just haven't been programmed to say that number 17. Oh, oh, that's a nice play. Yeah, see what I mean, bro? Every time I pause the game and unpause it at a certain time, like, I just concede. I knew it was going to happen. What a pass that is from Ono Masaki. Oh, Hashimoto, bro. Come on, G. Got to do better there, but that was quality from Ono Masaki. You see, it's so tough, bro, because one formation we lose Ono Masaki, and one formation, we lose Morgan Elliott. And they're two players that I feel like need to be playing. But then at the same time, we have these two strikers who have no chemistry. But then they need to be playing as well. So it's gonna be, it's so tough. How do we get those two into a team? We can't. We literally can't play the two strikers without losing someone important. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. That's a nice play. Ronaldo! Oh, what a save. I was ready to hit a big fat suey in the preseason, but. Oh, you see, that's why we need Ono Masaki in there. I'm not even asked that, he's, that we've lost it now, but <laughs> that touch was just sexy, bro. So much talk about a potential transfer, but it's potential no more. It's fat. Yeah, There's Lewandowski. He's got a bit of space to work with. He wants a long shot. Oh, what a strike that is. Lewandowski, bro. <laughs> yeah, this guy is special. That guy is special. Oh, boys, I'm going to have to play him on I this season. That is sensational, bro. I just saw the bit of space to work with. I know he's fast on the ball, so I thought, you know what? I can burst into that space. And we've done it. And what a strike, bro. Oh, the way he holds off two defenders there as well. And then gets the shot in. That's great. That is fantastic. What a player. I actually like him more than Ronaldo already. In fact, do I? Nah, that's cap. I can't say that yet. Big tackle, Hashimoto. Ronaldo. Come on, Ronaldo. Come on, Ronaldo. In fact, this is all him. Sui. What a goal that is. And he's about to hit it. Sui. Let's go. What a tackle that is from Canales, bro. All my days. Link up. Nice turn. Oh, no. Oh, that was going in. That boy's, I'm telling you. So is this. I'm glad I'm feeling myself this game, you know, just sitting it from anywhere. Big head from Shin Maya there. Looking to make an impact. Well in, son. That's what we love to see. Hashimoto. Oh, lad. Hey, that was heavy from Shin there. He's really wanting to make an impact. He doesn't want to go out on loan, but I feel like for next season, he will be our player. Yeah, I feel like I've got the, the plan sort of. We send him out on loan, but 93 to 94 potential is crazy, bro. A very effective clearance. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Nice turn there from Ronaldo and Villic. Linking up nicely. Come on. Can they do it? No, they've just got no chemistry. It's going to take time, but I'm sure they'll build that bridge between each other. Need to do some, like, team building exercises or something, bro. Like, make them hold hands around the campfire and sing fucking Kumbaya or something, lad. Go on, keep it well in. There they go again. Linking up. Lewandowski the first touch. Look at the speed of him, lad. He's only got 88 pace. The speed's mad. And again, lad. Oh, lad. Hey, he's quality him, you know. What a bargain. I can't believe he got him off the free agents, bro. But what a win that was. Yeah. Oh, mate. I'm looking forward to this season, you know. Let's, should we just skip preseason now and get into the league? I feel like the 4 one 2 one 2 narrow formation, while it was good for Morgan Elliott, everyone else played stinky. Yeah. This formation, I'm cooking with it, but there's no Morgan Elliott in it. So, yeah, I don't know what to do, really. Let me know in the comments, boys. Help me out with this situation. But I feel like we definitely need to... To keep my man there, do you know what I mean? Dream Chasers have claimed the title in to round off this international season. What? Wait, what? The preseason's over. Wait, what? We, we just won the preseason tournament. I didn't even realise we only played three games, lad. 
You only played three games. That's it. And we won the tournament on one goal difference. That's crazy. That Wait, what? There's no, like, round of 16 league. I thought there was a league after the group stage. I don't know. I don't even care, to be honest. Like I said, let's get to the normal season, bro. And um, we've got the FA Cup against Manchester United. That's huge. That is huge. What is... Uh, did I say the FA Cup? I meant the Community Shield, bro. The Community Shield against Manchester United, which is the FA Cup winner against the league winner, isn't it? So, yeah. We're playing Man United. That'll be huge. If we could win the, the Community Shield, what a way to start the season that'd be. Stin Meyer said, nice one for playing us. Boss, I'm uh, desperate to show everyone what I can bring to the team. And it was a great performance from the lad, uh, I will admit. We got 4.9 million for winning the preseason tournament there. So, we only have 34 million in the budget still. But, yeah. Hopefully, Antonio Silva gets off soon. We've got an offer back from Bologna for Antonio Silva for 51.2 million. That is absolutely huge. I said I wanted 50 million for him. And I think, boys, 50 million is a great deal to get for Antonio Silva. 22 years old, 79 overall. Definitely still room to grow a little bit. But he's only at the club since as his status, which means it's not even that much further to grow. But 51 million, I will take that all day. And hopefully, we can sign Gavardiol with that money now. Got a transfer offer for Reese Davies, 1.3 million from Toronto. I'm going to accept that straight away. That's a nice bit of money to get for him. Uh, I'm going to offer for Morgan Elliott, 18 million from Leicester City. Blocking offers for Morgan Elliott. He is going nowhere. Yeah, I don't care how much you offer me. And that's an insult. 18 million for one of the best players in the world. Got a 55.5 million offer for Mina from Bayern Munich. Now that's very tempting, but another one I'm going to reject because I absolutely love Juan Jose Mina, one of our best players for sure. Uh, and we've had an email saying, I'm writing in regard to our upcoming match against Manchester United. I have concerns that our current captain may be struggling in the role. I want to propose appointing Manuel Neuer as captain. You mean the man on the reserves? I don't think so. That's so cheeky to say, especially when our team sheet currently has Morgan Elliott as captain. Yeah, I'm switching it back, though, to the 4-4-2 formation. In fact, did we go back to the old school 4-4-1-1 for the sake of it? Because it's the it's an important game. I'm tempted to bring it back, boys, to the original formation with the one striker. Just because I know that was solid in that. And we can experiment in the league because this is a one-off game. I don't know. I'm going to try it out next episode. Anyway, I'm going to leave you on the cliffhanger. We will play the FA Cup game in the next episode. If you have enjoyed, like, comment, share, and subscribe. In fact, you know what, actually? Let's play it this episode.